Om Danvantaraye Namaha. Okay. It was a long time since I didn't make any video because I had to update my whole system. So I'm happy to be back and today I want to introduce the concept of 108 and I just want to read an article about it. Uh, it's called The Significance of the Number 108. The Indian subcontinent rosary or set of mantra counting has 108 beads. 108 has been a sacred number in the Indian subcontinent for a very long time. This number is explained in many different ways. The, in, the ancient Indians were excellent mathematics and 108 may be the product of a precise mathematical operation e.g. 1 power 1 multiplied by 2 power 2 multiplied by 3 power 3 is 1 multiplied by 4 multiplied by 27 is 108 which was thought to have a special numerolo numerological significance. Powers of 1, 2 and 3 in math 1 to first power is 1, 2 to second power is 4 and 3 to third power means 3 multiplied by 3 multiplied by 3 is 27 so here we have 1 multiplied by 4 multiplied by 27 is 108. In the Sanskrit alphabet there are 54 letters. Each has masculine and feminine, Shiva and Shakti. 54 times multiplied by 2 is 108. Sri Yantra, the geometry of Om. There are marmas where three lines intersect and there are 54 such intersections. Each intersection has masculine and feminine, Shiva and Shakti qualities. So again we have 54 multiplied by 2 and that's 108. Thus there are 108 points that define the Sri Yantra as well as the human body. 9 times 12 both of these numbers have been said to have spiritual significance in many tradition. 9 times 12 is also 108. 1 plus 8 equals 9. That 9 times 12 equals 108. The heart chakra. The, heart ch uh, the chakras are the intersections of energy lines and there are said to be a total of 108 energy lines converging to form the heart chakra. One of them, Shushumna, leads to the crown chakra and it is said to be the path to self-realization. Marmas or Mamastanas are like energy intersections called chakras, except have fewer energy lines converging to form them. There are said to be 108 mamas or mama points in the subtle body, where we are again at the Ayurveda tradition. So, time. Some say there are 108 feelings, with 36 related to the past, 36 related to the present, and 36 related to the future, which makes 108. Astrology. There are 12 constellations and 9 arc segments called Nangshas or Chandrakalas. 9 times 12 is again 108. Chandra is moon and Kalas are the divisions within a whole. So these are the 
stations of the moon. Planets and houses. In astrology there are 12 houses and 9 planets. 12 times 9 again equals 108. There are also 100 Wait a second. Gopis of Krishna. In the Krishna tradition, there were said to be 108 gopis or maidservants of Krishna. Well, I can add that actually they were all expansions of Radharani, his internal complete Shakti, and they were her principal moods. So, 108 gopis. 1, 0, and 8. 1 stands for God or higher truth, 0 stands for emptiness or completeness in spiritual practice, and 8 stands for infinity or eternity. Sun and Earth. The diameter of the Sun is 108 times the diameter of the Earth. Numeroli numer numerical scale. The 1 of 108 and the 8 of 108 when added together equals 9, which is the number of the numeral, numero, numerical scale, i.e. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, etc., where 0 is not a number. Smaller divisions. The number 108 is divided, such as in half, third, quarter or twelfths, so that some malas have 54, 36, 27 or 9 beads. Malas means like garlands or chains. Islam. The number 108 is used in Islam to refer to God. Jain. The Jain religion. Um, 108 are the combined virtues of five categories of holy ones, including 12, 8, 36, 25 and 27 virtues respectively. Sikh tradition has a mala of 108 knots tied in a string of wool rather than beads. Chinese Buddhists and Taoists use a 108 bead mala which is called Su Chu and has three dividing beads, so the mala is in divided into three parts of each 36. Stages of the soul said that Atman, the human soul or center, goes through 108 stages on the journey. Meru. This is a larger bead, not part of the 108. It is not tied in the sequence of the other beads. It is the guiding bead, and the one that marks the beginning and end of the mala. Meru is also uh, uh, the access mountain of the universe in the Vedic cosmology. Dance. There are 108 forms of dance in Indian traditions. Pythagorean. The 9 is the limit of all numbers. All other existing and coming from the same, i.e. 0 to 9, is all one needs to make up an infinite amount of numbers. We have listed below 108 Upanishads as per the list contained in the Muktikopanishad. We have arranged them in four categories according to the particular Veda to which each of them belong. I'm not going to read all the Upanishads now. So, the significance of the number 108. We must agree that all measuring systems are merely reference frames. They give us a starting point. It doesn't really matter if you call them Fahrenheit or cycles. All science is based on fundamental assumptions of the mechanics of this universe. Yet these assumptions, if correct, connect like building blocks. So the rest we will read in the second video. See you soon. Enjoy.